Do you want to build the biggest tower? Look at that tower. Do you want to build multiple towers? Do you want to know how to get the ticket bumps? Do you want to get the most tickets out of playing Angry Birds Corn Crash? If you said yes to any of those questions, then this is the right video for you. In this video, we're going to show you how to play and win Angry Birds Corn Crash, one of the newest coin crushers currently in exclusive at Dave & Buster's. Hashtag not sponsored. First, let's learn the basics on how to read the game display. From the top, there are three displays. It shows amounts for the bonus coins, super bonus, and bonus tickets. The left side shows your tower coins display showing how many coins are in your tower. It adds up and will show your final height of your tower once it is built. The tower builder spin displays how many spins you have. The spins help determine the height of your tower. The display is only used after you've gotten the tower bonus and entered the tower building phase. The right side has four displays. The tower timer display is only used in the tower building phase. It counts down how much time you have to build the tower. The coin display shows how many coins you have. You get coins when you swipe your card. The tickets display shows how much tickets that are owed to you and will be sent to your card. The last display is the coin tickets. This shows how much tickets you get when coins fell off the edge. Once this starts counting up, it adds this amount to your tickets display. Again, showing how much tickets you earned and is being sent to your card. The center is divided into three sections that control the bonus coins, tower bonus, and ticket bonus. Depending on the bonus you get, you will need to aim for that same color slot as that bonus. The yellow bird is for the coin bonus. The red controls the tower bonus, and the blue bird slot controls the ticket bonus. When a coin drops into those slots, whatever is lit up when that coin goes through the slot is what you will get. The yellow bird wheel drops more coins. The blue bird wheel gives tickets, and the red bird wheel gives both, either tickets or coins, depending on what is lit up when the coin goes through. To light up each bird section's levels, you will need to drop it when the light is at the top of the wheel. Cool, we got the tower, 25 tickets. Once you reach the highest level, you get the perspective bonus defined by that amount specified above the area. Oh. Got the bonus tickets, 150 right there. There we go. If you get it in between the bird slots, a single bonus coin drops from the bonus coin area on the left. The bottom section is the coin field. This is the area where all the coins are. The only thing you really need to understand here is you only get tickets from the coins that fall into the center area marked winner. If it falls into the missed section, you don't get anything. Next, we'll go over how to win the coin bonus. To win the coin bonus, you will need to drop coins into the yellow bird slot at the right time when the yellow wheel's coins area is lit. Like this. Each time you do this, you will get the bonus on that yellow level. Once you get to the top level, you will win the bonus coin jackpot defined at the top of the coin pusher. Here, I would get 100 bonus coins, but it could change depending on where you're playing and how they have the settings set. The coins one here drop from the left hand side. To win the ticket bonus, it is just like the coin bonus, but on the blue side. Drop the coin, get into the blue bird slot at the right time when the blue bird's wheel is lighting up tickets, and you will get a level of the blue bird's bonus level. Once you reach the top of the level, you will win the ticket bonus. On this machine, I won 150 tickets. Probably the most important, what everybody wants to get when playing this game is how to build towers. To build towers, you need to reach the tower building minigame. Fill the red levels by dropping coins in the red bird's wheel while tower is lit up. You'll need to do this five times. Oh, got the tower, there it is. It's last level, it's tower time. It's tower time, so turn on. I'm 185, let's see how many I can do. Once you do this, you will have 30 seconds to drop coins in any of the bird slots. Each coin that goes through the slots gives you a spin. At the end, it will spin the tower wheel on the left hand side. Oh, almost got that egg right there. To win the super bonus, you will need to reach the tower building mini game. During the tower spin phase, the ball needs to drop in the egg slot enough times to light up five eggs and you win the super bonus. Oh, got the egg, got the super bonus, 507. There are four ways to win tickets on Angry Birds Coin Crush. You earn tickets by dropping coins into the Blue Bird spin slot. Oh, I got the ticket bonus. I got the ticket bonus 150 right there. Dropping coins into Red Bird spin slot. 
Ooh, got the tower. 25. Drop your coins in the winner bucket in front. Or winning the super bonus. Last, I want to tell you what my strategy is for building the biggest towers and knocking them over. The best strategy I've found is to make sure you have a lot of coins before you reach the tower building phase. Right when you light the fourth level in the red bird wheel, make sure you have more than 100 coins if you want to build a big tower. Just know that a big tower is a bit harder to push over once it gets closer to the edge. Once the tower is built, I do one of two things. If I'm playing for a while, I'll aim for building another tower. If not, I'll just aim for the yellow bird wheel so that it'll drop extra coins to help push the tower. If the tower is really tall, it will make it pretty heavy. So having the tower or the huge amounts of coins that the yellow bird wheel will drop will stack up in the round space where the tower is made and push the tower. If you ever get three towers on the coin field, the tower in front will fall pretty quickly. Just know that there will be some suspenseful moments thinking that it's not going to fall, but it'll definitely fall once a few coins fall on the field. So basically, long play, if you build a tower, build another tower. But if you want to just do a short play, you just want to build one tower and knock it over, then aim for the yellow bird wheel bonus to help push that tower over. That is a long play strategy. A short play strategy is if you're just trying to get tickets, you're only going to be paying for like 50 coins, I would aim for the blue bird wheel and just get tickets. Unless you have a big tower there and you just want to push it off, then of course, again, aim for the yellow. That is pretty much everything on how to play Angry Birds Coin Crush. Get out there, have some fun, and get a lot of tickets. Don't forget to share your experiences playing this fun coin pusher. I look at the comments all the time, and I love seeing everyone share their experiences. This is Platinum Mike. Thanks for subscribing. Don't forget to like, click that bell notification, and we'll see you next time at the arcade. Had to wait for it. <laughs>